Hey, Mike with D2D Millionaire here. In today's video, we're going to talk about the idea of how to overcome the rookie wall. So if you're newer in door-to-door -door sales, maybe you're just getting started, uh, there's going to come a point, if it hasn't already, uh, where you just kind of feel like you've hit a wall, right? You know, maybe this is your first time in sales. Uh, maybe this is your first time doing door-to-door. -door. There's going to be a big learning curve, right? So you're going to go through, maybe you're going to, this is the most rejection you've ever faced in your entire life. You know, every few minutes, someone's not answering their door. They're saying no, some are saying yes, but maybe if you're new, you haven't really mastered your skill set yet. So you are getting a lot of no's and a lot of rejection and you just kind of feel like you're not really getting anywhere. It's almost like you're, you're running on a treadmill to nowhere. And the good news is, if you've lasted this long, you know, three, four weeks, a couple months so far, whatever it is, uh, you're most likely almost through that rookie wall. And there's a couple tips you can use um, to, you know, basically get through that faster and start getting great results. So one thing you really want to keep in mind is make up in numbers what you lack in skill. So if you're not going through a lot of numbers, that can hinder you, right? You need to talk to a lot of people and eventually the law of averages is gonna work in your favor. Basically, as you talk to enough people, some of them are gonna say yes. So just keep your eye on the prize and keep going through those numbers and you're gonna to start to get yeses. But in the meantime, while you're doing that, you wanna be working on your skill set. So how can you do that? Well, there's a couple ways. You can you know, ask people that are already successful in your office, in your sales team, you know, find the people that are doing the best in your business and ask them, you know, what are they doing? How are they saying things? Learn from those people, match and model them so you can get results faster. Another thing is you want to take away something basically from every door that you knock on. So let's say, for example, you try an icebreaker and it just totally fails. Well, what did you learn there? Keep that in mind. Always ask yourself, what did I learn? What do they learn? So every time you make a mistake or something doesn't go how you want it to, just learn in your mind, okay, well, that way it doesn't work. I need to switch it up for next time or I need to change it a little bit. Another great thing you can do is ask if you know one of your managers can, can go with you or go on the doors with some other different sales reps that maybe are getting results. And so you can see their process and see how they go through it. Um, it's a great way to learn because maybe they're making mistakes that you're not or you hear them do uh, a greeting or you hear them talk about a specific aspect of your business and it's just not getting results. Well, you know now that you shouldn't do that. So you can learn from their mistakes as well as from what they're doing correct. So learn and match and model, find people that are getting results and copy what they're doing. Um, you're going to get results a lot faster. But at the same time, practice kind of in your off season, right? So maybe you stay a little bit later on the door. So you, again, you can get some more m numbers in. Maybe you come in early to the office, ask your sales manager some questions, you know, work on your skills a little bit. You're going to get better results that way. Uh, if you haven't read the book yet, Door to Door Millionaire, pick up a copy of that. It'll go through a bunch of different training that you can use and plug into uh, to, to increase your skill set and help you get through that learning curve faster. So again, if you're struggling, you're not getting the results, you feel like you've hit that rookie wall, just ask yourself, what can I do to make myself better? Again, maybe that's reading books on sales, on leadership, on development and communication skills. If you haven't gotten the D2D Millionaire book, get that. It's Door to Door Millionaire. Make sure you pick up a copy. Uh, again, get our app so you can get more up-to-date training and specific coaching for yourself. Watch the different training videos on the D2D Millionaire site. All these different things, you can invest time and energy and you know maybe a little bit of money investing in yourself to improve your skill sets. You're going to get through that rookie wall and increase your sales significantly and it'll be worth the little time and effort that you put in practicing on your off time. So again, a couple different tips you can use to help you get through that rookie wall um, and you know increase your sales, keep that flow going throughout the year. And hopefully you guys got value out of this video. If you did, feel free to comment and share. And if you are in pest control marketing and sales, be sure to head on over to d2dmillionaire.com. Just enter your name and email. You're gonna get access to our free video training on how to overcome the eight most common objections and concerns in pest control marketing and door-to-door -door sales. So if you ever got an objection, like I need to think about it, I need to talk to my spouse, I'm not really seeing any pests right now, 
and a whole bunch more, uh, again, go to ddmillionaire.com, just enter your name and email, and you're going to get access to that free video training. But again, thanks so much for tuning in. We'll look forward to talking to you more soon.